How's it going everyone? Welcome back. So have you ever wondered on how to solve these unavailable problems on FaceTime so when you try to call someone from your iPhone? Well, it happens to me a couple of times and I've solved it and I want to show you guys how you can solve this problem as well. Now this problem mainly happens for software glitch or if you have a poor internet connection. So first thing we are going to take a look at is the internet. So you can open up a browser and tap, uh, simply type fast.com. This website will tell you how much speed you currently are having with your current network. If it's pretty low, you can enable airplane mode for about 10 to 1 second for the quick restart from the network, or you can switch your network. If you are using mobile data, I highly recommend you just go and enable Wi-Fi, just try to connect it and see if that works or not, or do the vice versa to see if that helps you out solve your problems or not. So let's say you've done it, but still you have the same problems. The next thing we are going to take a look at is a simple thing. Just go to the general here, tap iPhone storage, and find out the FaceTime. Uh, so we'll select offload app, tap upload app again, and then tap reinstall app. So what this will do, this will not eliminate your data, but this will actually remove the bugs or glitches that can cause the problem. So just go ahead and offload app and see if that solve your problems or not. The next thing so we are going to take a look at the contact itself. So in this uh, way, all you got to do is just simply head over to the contact and select the contact that you are having problems with. Simply tap edit here and please take a look at his phone number or the email address. This should be 100% correct. If they change it and you are trying to, to call, you know, you're trying to call their uh, email or from phone number from my message this will not work so in that case you can call to the person and ask for the facetime or the iMessage or you know a facetime email or number and that gives you you add them again and try to just call them again and see if that works or not and the next into aria and take a look at is a restriction guys sometime putting on restriction in facetime can cause similar problems to simply open up your settings here scroll down to the screen time scroll down tap on content and privacy restriction so make sure to disable that settings from your iphone here now get out of here restart your iphone and i can tell you guys your problem is going to be solved right after that if you still have problems guys the last thing that you guys can do you can completely delete the facetime directly from your iphone and reinstall it back again from your app store and see if that works or not. So after following all of that, I can tell you guys your problem is going to be solved. But still, if you have a problem, please let me know in the comment section for the further help. See you guys around.